good to see everyone. Hi. Good to yeah. be here. How you doing? Good to see you again, Luke. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, Nicola, I want to start. Congratulations, first of all. This is incredible. I'm so happy for you. Thank um, you so much. This three head. This three-headed monster, though, right, of, like, writing, directing, acting, I mean, what was that kind of like for you, journey-wise? Like, was it, like, harder than you thought? Was it a little easier than you thought? Like, I'm just curious about that. Um, well, I, I wasn't planning on directing, but once I made that decision, I just never looked back, and I, I just gave it my everything. But I guess the biggest challenge for me was, you know, as a director, you have to make sure that you make your day because an independent yeah. film, you just never have enough time. And you, you, there's always a shot you wanted to get. There's always something you're like, oh, I wish I had more time for that. And, and yeah. but I never wanted my actors to feel that. And um, I always wanted them to feel like they were in a safe place. And, and if they didn't like a line or they felt, you know, they wanted to stand up in the scene or, or sit down in the scene, or, or I wanted them to really follow their instincts. Like I was so blessed and so lucky to get the chance to work with such talented, such talented actors. And, and I just wanted them honestly to follow their instinct and the most, and, and all the takes I picked, I felt like it, it, that's what they did. They just followed their instincts and they were just so incredible in this film. And I feel very lucky. Absolutely. And Virginia, you know, a lot of the, you know, scenes in this film and the subject matter from a, like a viewer perspective, it's not easy to watch. It's really tough to watch and everything. And I'm just wondering from an acting perspective, I mean, is there kind of like a coping mechanism or preparation knowing that you're going to be a character that a lot of people are going to have a hard time kind of watching? I'm just wondering what if there's a mindset with that, like before going in and filming. Well, I mean, we were fortunate as a cast to have our director get us together for a little bit of rehearsal, but mainly for bonding so that you knew that, okay, it's going to be okay on the set. And, you know, there was a particular scene, you know, which one that I really, really did not want to do and sort of argued against it. And, and you were right because it was the hardest scene to do, but it was right for the movie and loop bless your heart, like you were so cool about it. And yeah. I just didn't want you to, cause now you're like an adult, but like you were so little and I just didn't want you to, to really feel like I was this awful lady. And, and so, but I think we had a really closed, protective set, you know, the, the, it maybe it was because we were so restricted because of all the COVID rules, but it kind of felt like we were just a, a family and we didn't have uh, outside influences um, getting in the way. Mm -hmm. This is actually Luke. So Luke, yeah, this is your fourth time on the show. Last, The first time we spoke, you were filming Lola, which is great. Oh <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh, wow. wow. Did he it's have long, long hair or short hair? Yeah, was he, he had long, long hair? hair? He looks like, he looks like, it, yeah, he looks like in, in, in Lola with the long hair. Oh, I love it. And it's just funny because then since then we've done like three more interviews. So it's cool to see every year and everything. But I just wanted to ask them very quickly before we wrap up. I mean, for you with this script, um, what was that kind of journey like reading it, preparing, seeing all these characters, seeing everything, and then going and filming it specifically? So, um... As soon as I got the audition in, I was like super excited because it was, I mean, the scenes were just great. Even ju just the audition scenes were amazing and it was super fun to film. And uh, like as soon as we flew out, we were in the um, Beverly Hills Hotel doing rehearsal. We just hung out for a couple days. And then when we started filming, it was just, it was just an amazing experience. Everyone was so nice on set. And I mean, I, I, this was just like the perfect people to film this. Like everybody, everybody did an amazing job. And it was just, it was just so fun. And playing this character was amazing. It was so, your Absolutely. chemistry together was so beautiful and so gentle. And it really felt like you were a brother and sister and she was trying to, to help you through life. I, it was, it was beautiful. I love that. And and you weren't bad either. <laughs> he is very easy to act with. Yeah. Absolutely. No, I can't wait for people to see it. Congratulations. It was great to chat with all of you. Thank you so much for your time and congratulations about Lola. Thank you for tuning in to Pop Turnative. 
make sure to check out our past episodes of Poptternative on YouTube. This has been an Autograph Communications production.